like a stunt tutorial. The main thing about stunt riding that people should learn first is to have Figure eight, party boys. Yeah. All right, guys, so why don't I do like a stunt tutorial? Can I just tell you a little bit of tips and tricks? I'm gonna this video is not going to show you how to catch idle and stuff, but I'll just give you some things that uh, help me out learning. First and foremost, the first part of your wheelies are the clutch. You pop the clutch to get it up, or you should be if you're in like a lot or controlled environment trying to do a slow wheelie. So as you can see, the idle is pulling me enough to where the bike's not going to stall out if I let go. I'm not touching the throttle, but it's just, it's pulling. And it's not enough to where it's pulling me too fast and it kind of paranoids me. This, And that's through your idle. You might have it up here, you might have it down here, but you change your idle enough to where it's pulling you without having to do anything. And I can kind of swerve it around, do all that shit, and it's good. Bars go straight. So, with that being said, now that you have your idle nice and uh, where you want it, Think about this idle, think about this speed. Is this the speed if you're not using any throttle? Is this uh, too fast or too slow for a wheelie that you're gonna be in? Because this is the idle that you're gonna be at. If you're at perfect balance point and you're not using any throttle, this is the speed that your wheelies should be at when you do a wheelie, so watch. The clutch up is key though. You pop it up high enough, you don't have to chase it out. And then you use brake to get it right where it needs to be. Tap, tap, too high. Too high, too high, too high, tapping it, 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 tapping it. As, as it comes up, you just tap it down, tap it down, tap it down. And then when you want to start going fast, you start using less brake and more throttle to keep it up. We'll learn clutch in another episode. <laughs> So this is recon it right now. You're just kind of creeping around the lot. You're not in a tight circle. You're just kind of moving around. And once you get that idle perfect, this is your throttle, obviously. So you can start to just take your hand off and work nothing but brake. So I'm gonna go back into a C stander. Everybody knows all I do is my circles to the left. So if I try to maneuver it to the right, it's gonna be a lot harder because I'm not used to it, but I'm learning. Ooh, sketchy. So just to reiterate, your idle's gotta be high enough to where if you let go of your bike, it's not gonna stall out. That's if you're doing a lot of idle wheelies. So the bike's good, kind of move it around, it's gonna stay straight. That's all about maintenance. Making sure all your shit's nice and tight. That's that's key right there. If your bike's all loose and shit, you could be the best rider ever, but you drop it that one time, your bike falls apart, you snap something major, and then you're out of riding for a long ass time. So make sure all your shit's tightened down and good to go first and foremost. <laughs> winding down time of the day. Everybody's just getting their last little bit of practice in. Him, him, him. Woo. No panic. Josh killing it, man. I need to get these figure eights uh, at his goal. Yeah. Now that I got plastics, I'm kind of like, like addicted to like grabbing onto shit. Anything and everything. Mm-hmm. 
stunt riding that people should learn first is to have fun. That's all what it's about. I'm just kidding, but for real, that is the main thing. Enjoy what you're doing. Don't do it just because you want to prove something to somebody. When you start enjoying stunt riding and just coming out having fun, no matter what the sacrifices are to get it done, that's when you start progressing and not even noticing it. I was garbage as fuck. And the thing about me is I still think I'm garbage and I can improve on shit. I get you level headed though. That's what you need. Clutch work to drop it into the other way. That's a sexy looking trick right there. You don't really use any of your body. You just kind of snap it high enough and then throttle and brake control. <laughs> See, that was a terrible snap. When it pops up all sideways, it means I didn't pop it up nice and smooth. Body was off in the first place. Smooth. Mousetrap, it'll get you. Oh, add it to the collection. <laughs> yeah. 
Get off me with your, your fucking tippy toeing ass. It's gonna cost you to touch this, baby. Can't just be touching old Betsy like that. You know what'll help it? <laughs> 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 